Dr. Kenneth Thompson says it's not uncommon to see patients under the age of 17 come into his office. Yeah, definitely. I mean, there's a big teenager, uh, you know, group of teenagers that come in regularly for birth control. That's why he wasn't surprised by the AAP suggestion that doctors prescribe morning after pills to girls under 17 more often. Right now, the medicine is available without a prescription at any pharmacy for about $50. But if you are under 17, you need a doctor's note. In Horry County, about 28 teens between the ages of 15 and 19 give birth each month. That's down from 2011, but still one of the highest birth rates in the state. The impact of making the morning after pill more accessible had a lot of you talking on Facebook. Carol Owens said kids today will find a way to take advantage of this too. They think it's okay to go out and have sex without protection, thus taking chances of getting STDs. While Karen Hillary wrote, when my daughter got pregnant, she blamed me for not providing her birth control. I'm so glad I didn't. My grandson John is most amazing. Dr. Thompson says the most important thing from this is to get teens, sexually active or not, talking. It's the conversation. I think it's also getting them into an obstetrician gynecologist. Doesn't mean they have to be started on something, but at least to have the chance to talk about it.